Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Temu haul for you. Uh, this is actually two orders, but the first one wasn't that large, so I figured I would just combine them. I had ordered the first one a few weeks ago, and then the second one came in while we were gone. Uh, so I opened it up and checked everything once we were back. But I'm going to go ahead and get started. So the first thing I wanted to show you, I thought this was adorable. It is a little miniature uh, playing card set. Now, at first when I was doing it, I was wondering why it only comes with one card set but two boxes. But once you get it all together, because these are so small... They look thicker when you stack them up and only two suits will fit in each box. So you kind of have to have the two boxes, but they also give you a strip of uh, double-sided tape to close the boxes up. Now the one box I have closed, the second one I don't, but I did put them together. You can see how small the cards are. And I just thought these were so cute. I had to have them. So this is what the box looks like when you get it closed up. Now it does come apart really easy. Uh, the tape that I used wasn't the tape they gave me. So I'm going to see if on the other one their tape works better. But I really liked it. And this is the double-sided strip that they gave and then you can see just how small these cards are. They are tiny, but I thought they were really cute. Now, what I may end up doing them for, using them for, I may not keep them in the little box. I may just use them in crafting. I don't know. Um, I think they'd make good little ephemera bits, but yeah. So that is that one. And then the second thing I got, now for me, <clears throat> growing up, we, Care Bears was a big thing, uh, the cartoon, everything. So I grabbed these when I saw them because they were so adorable. They are diamond paintings, but they're the little uh, sticker set. So I went ahead and got them and they do have two sheets and they did, they do have on there, I noticed the other day when I was looking, there is a second set of these that it's more just like the, the head part, uh, for some of them. And I don't remember what else all was on there. So I'm going to try to get the second set as well, just to have on hand. But I thought uh, those were super cute. It comes with the regular kit that all diamond paintings come with. Uh, so I will be working on that and showing it to you guys once it is finished. And I have, I've been working on a couple of diamond paintings. So once I have like a good selection, I'm going to do a video of them being finished. The next thing I got was this little uh, needle kit. And I've just been trying to get some needles on hand for different things. Now this one is more like sewing size needles, but I think they have the easy thread on there. So that's good. And it tells you the size of the needle and how many come in each. So I thought that was really cute. And then it comes with this little container to store them in. So that is nice because you know how easy needles get lost. So I thought that was really cute. But then I got a, an actual diamond painting this time. Uh, I've got so many, but I like collecting them. I like working on them. They're very relaxing. So this one is not very large. It is a 30 by 40 and it's hard to know 
what a diamond painting is going to look like for the size. On Temu, they have a lot of, uh, a lot of the, the diamond paintings that they have on there have a picture showing you what it would look like. So some of them you can tell it's too small for the detail that's in it. But this one I thought looked pretty nice for the size. It looked, it looked decent. So I figured I would go ahead and grab it. And that is the picture right there. And you can see all of the symbols are really clear. So that's nice. And it does tell you, it gives you a canvas number and then it gives you the size on here. And then of course you have your little key. And again, it comes with the standard kit. It, you've got your wax, your boat, and your pen. And then you have your drills. And again, this is a round painting. I do prefer round over the square. So I'm going to put that back. Next, I got this little... Uh, wooden tarot card holder. Now I wanted to flip it over just because they put a little note on here, which I thought was really cute. I think it just, you know, it gives that little something extra from the store. So I really appreciate that. But this is just a little wooden piece. It's not, you know, it's not heavy duty or anything. I mean, I say heavy duty. It's not, uh, Anything, you know, like super fancy, but I really liked it. And you've got your elements on here. So you've got your, your fire, your water, spirit, your air, and your earth. I don't know why that's missing the E, but yeah. So I got that. I thought that was really cute. And that's to put tarot, your three card tarot card drawing in there or if you just want to do a single card you can okay the next thing i got i got several of these colors they are little plushies i thought they were adorable they are the among us characters so this one is the purple one i also got the blue red orange and I think that was yeah that was all the colors I got this time I will probably get a few more colors uh if I can find them the um the one I ordered from only had these four no I think they had a few other colors I was trying to figure out what colors I should get for the kids but then I just decided what I'll probably do is get the entire collection if I can. So I have to figure out how many colors there are. Uh, because, I mean, I've watched them play, but I don't know how many characters there are. So I'm going to go do, do that. But for now, I've only got the, the four. And I will probably do two sets. Because these are going to be for my two youngest. And I'll probably do a set for each of them. Okay, the next thing I got was this cord... And it's not stretchy or anything, but I thought that either I could use this to make bracelets, because I think it would be a really good cord for that. Um, I don't know if I would use these for journal making, because they are really thick. So this might just be for um, the uh, keychains not keychains. Well, yeah, you could use them for keychains as well, but for like the bracelets. The keychains, if you have bigger beads, that might be a good option. Okay, I got this set of needles, and they are beading needles. So making chunky charms or making a journal that you want to put like beads on the end or anything like that these are supposed to make and i i don't know how to show you 
yeah, because they're it's not gonna it's not gonna focus. But they are beading needles, and you can see here. Let me put those down. <laughs> they're really really thin, so they're really hard to grip. All right, so if you can see, I'm going to try to, I don't have any nails right now. I um, chopped all of my nail, nails off because they were breaking. But there is a slice in the needle. If you can see that, there is a slice in there. And it's supposed to make it to where it's easy to get the thread in. And then, okay, it's like I can see it. And then once I try to grab it, it doesn't work. Um, let's see. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Ah, oh, shoot. I had it. I had it. But you see the, you can see it sometimes when it pops open. There we go. See that? So you can put your thread in there. And then your beads are going to be easier to get on the thread. So I got that. Uh, and again, it comes in a tube that is really nice. Keeps them together. And then the tube comes in its own little package as well. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right. Next thing I got was this little stamp. I just thought it was adorable. So I went ahead and grabbed it. I have been trying to find more dragon items as far as crafting goes. Um, I don't, <coughs> excuse me. There are a lot of like cartoony dragon stamps and stuff, but I like to do the more like realistic look. And there are very few of the cartoon ones that I think are cute enough to buy. This one I thought was cute enough to buy. Now there are some that have like these, these small ones that are just freaking adorable. And I will probably eventually get all of those as well. But yeah, I figured I'd start with this one. Now Pink Ink Designs, they have one that I got and oh, I absolutely love it. And it, it comes with like the wing stamps as well. And it's just like a, a headshot kind of of the dragon. So if you're looking for more realistic, look at Pink Ink Designs. Okay, got some more stickers. I love their sticker packs, as I've said before. And this one is pirate related. My oldest loves anything pirate so I went ahead and grabbed these for him. It's hard finding some, sometimes it's hard finding pirate things that aren't kid, you know, like little kid. So I was happy with that. Most of the stickers in there are not as kid friendly, I think. Okay, I got some bead packs. Now, these are seed beads. They are small. Uh, I, I like collecting the seed beads. I know some of the things that I want to do with them. I just haven't done it. <laughs> uh, trying to find the other packs of colors. And they arrived in these little packages. Now, if I open them even just a little bit, they are going to spill out. So I'm not opening the seed beads because you all, I'm sure those of you that do anything with beads know how awful it is to clean these up. So I just got a few of the colors and I will probably grab more colors. I do need to get some more of the, like the containers to put these in. I don't have I believe I don't have any empty ones. No, wait. Yes, I do. I have an empty container in my drawer, so I will probably put them, go ahead and put them away. Um, but the containers I like to use, they are, they screw on and off and they come from Walmart. 
and they're only a dollar. So if you look in Walmart's bead section, they have them there. And I think a dollar is a pretty good price for what you're getting. Uh, but the containers are, I think, the best for the seed beads. Okay, this is just a pie server. And you can see it's very reflective. That is actually over by my, my bedroom door. Uh, it is black. It is a black color. And I don't have one. <laughs> I have not had a pie server ever, I don't think. Um, I don't know why. I Every time I'm cutting a pie, I'm thinking, you know, it would be really nice to have one of the... the pie servers and I never would get one. So when I saw this on Tamu, the price was right. I loved the color and I thought, you know what? I'm just gonna bite the bullet and get one because I do need, you know, I, we do have pies quite frequently. So I figured why not? <clears throat> My throat keeps getting clogged up. Okay. I found these and I got two different colors. And they are the cord again. And they these are a lot smaller. So these could be used for journals pretty easily. I might see how well it works. But I thought these would be good for doing keychains or bracelets or anything like that. So I figured why not. So I got the purple and then I got the rainbow got those two. Then I got this little item for my son, uh, just as a little like fidget toy type thing. And it's whack-a-mole basically. So I thought that was really cute and it was a really good price. I've not taken the battery out or anything. I figured I'd let him do that so that, you know, he'd be able to play it for the first time. I got a couple, well, did I get a couple or did I only get one? I think I only got one in this one. Yeah, it looks like I only got one pack. I could have sworn I had more than one. Did I not, did I misplace it? I don't know. I'm going to have to find it because I thought I got more than one color, but this is just the, uh, for the wax, sealing wax. Um, I got, I think this one was the Galaxy. No, I don't know. I don't remember. <laughs> I've ordered so many things. But they're just like little, little pieces in there. And you just, um, the way they show it is using like all three colors just to get a little marbled effect or something. So I did get one of these. Could have sworn I got more than one color though. Oh yeah, there it is. This is the galaxy one. That's the galaxy one. So I really, really liked this one. Now this one has four colors in it. Cause this has the black, the white, no five colors. It has black, white, silver, blue, and the purple. So I grabbed that one as well. And I will be doing some videos with the wax sealing. I have, I think, a, a few of the kits that I need to show that showcase. So I grabbed a bag of these. They're just the little eye hooks. I've got a bunch of little bottles that I want to make little charms with. And I just needed to stock up on some more of the little eye hooks. Okay, next is this bracelet, and it is a Leo bracelet. As you all know, not a Leo bracelet, that was the other one. This is a dragon bracelet. I saw this one, and I thought this one was really cute. Um, it actually goes on pretty easy. You, and I know it's going to look difficult, but you just, you hook it right there it would focus and then you just push 
So it's really, really simple, but it looked really cute. Um, so I went ahead and grabbed that as well. Then I got a couple of keychains. Now this one is the Nightmare Before Christmas. It is the Jack Skellington keychain and it comes, it's got a little thing there and then it's got this here. So I went ahead and grabbed him and it's a good size keychain. So I got Jack and I got Oogie Boogie. So here is what he looks like and I think he's adorable. So I went ahead and grabbed him as well. I swear I'm probably going to end up having like several different key sets just so I can show off all of the, uh, um, yeah, I can't think all of the different keychains I've got. Okay. So the next few things I got were, uh, some little like crystal ball, crystal balls, but like little stone crystal balls. It's like, I don't know how to say it without saying crystal ball. Um, it's not like the clear crystal balls or anything like that. These are different stone types that you've got the rose quartz and I can't, I can't open it. Um, I don't, I got scissors. Hang on. Let me try to open this one at least because it's sealed at the top, but then it has like the zipper. So like you have to open it once and then you can just use like the, no, you can't because it doesn't, it, it's not stuck to the other side. So I'm sure some of them probably do, but that one doesn't. Anyway, so you've got the little rose quartz. I'm trying to focus on that. You have to excuse my fingers. They are not very good right now because I've been cleaning and yeah. So you've got the rose quartz. Then you've got the uh, Jasper. I think this one is Jasper. Then you've got this one, I think was Citrine, but I'm not 100% sure. I've got to look back. Uh, this one, you've got the Obsidian. This one, I do not remember. I, I just can't remember what it was. And then you've got the Amethyst. So quite a few different ones. Um, I liked the price point for those. They are small and they were kind of like the, the almost like the chakra based stones. They had some other ones I think on there, but they were out of stock at the, the time that I got them. I'll have to look back. Okay. Next thing I got was this witch's brew pin. It is just a single focus. It is just a single one, uh, but I thought it was really cute. So I went ahead and grabbed it. They had other pins, but this was the only one that I wanted at the time. So I went ahead and grabbed that. Okay. So the last items that I got were these coins and I love the little package that they come in. So I got the sun and moon. I got Anubis. You know, my cat's name is Anubis and I just thought it was, would be fun. And then you've got that on the back. And these are $1 coins, but I did not get them for that. I got them for the collector's value part, the just, just to have in my collection. I just liked the look of the coin and the same with the other ones that I got. I know my kids will just keep them for the collection, just to have in a collection. So I did get the T-Rex. 
I got the, that's not a T-Rex, I don't think, but I don't remember what it was. But I got that one as well. My daughter loves Jurassic Park, so I got that for her. I got the Green Man as well for myself. Then I got, uh, I gotta figure out which way to hold this. Okay. This one is the Plague Doctor. One of my sons loves the Plague Doctor. Uh, just the, the look of it. Eventually, I'm, I'm hoping to get him an outfit that he can wear to like Renaissance festivals uh, with the Plague Doctor look. Because he really, really likes it. So I got that for him. And then I got this one for my oldest because, of course, it is the pirate theme. And I will be looking for more for my other kids I just didn't see any that would have been appropriate for them uh, because it is my three youngest. And now the, when I say three youngest, the one is 14 and he will be 15 in a couple months. So he's not that young, but he's, he's not into like, he's not into the pirate thing. He's not into the plague doctor thing. He's more into like Sonic and Tails, uh, Pusheen the cat. Uh, he loves, what else does he love? Uh, he loves the, oh, what is that game? There's a game that he plays that my two one of my younger ones plays as well and I can't remember what it's called it has it's it's like a rhythm game and all I'm getting in my head is Five Nights at Freddy's and that's not it at all uh, uh Friday Night Funkin that's what it was oh my god Friday Night Funkin so he loves that he loves uh Minecraft and and you know stuff like that so I'm gonna I'm gonna try really hard to find for the last three because they they like collecting as well so I thought that would be really something really nice and easy and little that they could use you know as a collection but that was it that is what I got from Tammy this time and I do have more coming from them as part of a uh, collaboration, a review collaboration for them. So we'll be on the lookout for that. I have a peachy cheap haul that I need to do. And I think I'll be doing that by itself because I don't think I have anything else right now as far as hauls go. Uh, but I do have a bunch of crafting videos that I will be working on really soon. I'm just getting my house back in order from the pipes, having to get all the dust out, all the stuff put back in the kitchen. It's, it's going to take a while. So that is it for this video. If you like this content, please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye.